chilling video has emerged of the moment terrified Israel festival goers were forced to hide in an undergrowth to avoid a hail of bullets from Hamas gunmen in a massacre that has left some 260 civilians dead. Survivors of the attack posted clips showing them clawing under bushes and recording messages to their loved ones as they watched victims get slaughtered. Many lay petrified for more than five hours before they heard the sound of armed rescuers speaking in Hebrew. The Palestinian terrorists stormed the supernova festival near Kibbutz, close to the Gaza Strip, as part of its surprise assault on Saturday. Music at the deadly rave, which survivors said initially had good vibes, played all night until around 6.30 a.m. when a silent began warning of rockets. Festival goers knew there was a risk of rocket attacks, but they didn't expect a truckload of gunmen cutting power to the festival and storming the site, filing indiscriminately into the crowd. Terrifying footage shows innocent civilians screaming as shots are fired while police are seen trying to help people evacuate. Some are heard shouting go 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 as they clapped hands and splinted away from the oncoming trucks which followed behind splaying bullets. The Israel Rescue Service Zaka later said it had recovered at least 260 bodies in the aftermath of the attack. Cops of cops of young revealers were seen piled up on top of each other in makeshift tents last night as emergency workers tried to identify their remains. This morning, Halloween dash cam footage from the incident showed gunmen executing civilians as they lay in the sand before refreeing through their pockets and emptying bags from their cars. A distressing image shared in a pixelated form on Israel government's official Twitter page showed scores of victims placed in body bags at the site of the beautiful party that turned into a horrific massacre. Footage from the aftermath shows empty festival tents and abandoned cars frantically across the road riddled with bullets. The terrified victims had fled across the sand on foot to their cars in an attempt to drive away from the horrors only to be met with gunfire from attackers piled into jeeps going tree by tree in a search for targets.